what's up guys, PK Sparks here, welcome back to Splatdown, a competitive Splatoon series where I look at the various modes and map combinations you have to deal with when playing Splatoon online, and I'll give you guys my opinion, my favorite special weapons, the weapon I want to choose, all that and more. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to demolish that like button for me because you already know your support is greatly appreciated, and I know I just took Nappy's thing. But I've been imitating him a lot lately, so I'm sorry that just rolled off the tongue. But it's sincerely, but um, if I feel the same way, regardless of if I'm imitating the way he says it or not. So your support for the PK Planet will go a long way, and thank you all for your continued support. Now today's map and stage combination is Turf War, Moray Towers, and Flounder Heights. So I was thinking about this, and what we're going to pull out with is the Slosher. The reason why I want to run the Slosher is because while a roller works works really well on Moray Towers. It doesn't really work well on Flounder Heights because Flounder Heights has a lot of elevation. It's a lot of wide areas, but still a lot of elevation. So much elevation that a roller doesn't really work as well as someone would might have thought. Unless... You use the Carbon Roller. The carbon roller is really good um, because it can just sling ink fast, so you may get a little messed up, but you should be fine. But the downside is the ink zooka, once again, doesn't really work so well on Flounder Heights. It, that stage, while I like it a lot, it really does th just change it up a lot. So, we are going to be sticking with the slosher for this one. Um, my gear, I'm going to keep it as is because I'm still trying to... Um, to get this stuff leveled up. You guys can see that I got, um, I actually got lucky. Look at this. Look at that. The white arrow got three specials charged up and, and special duration is so good. Even got a hat with something like that. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. There we go. Got a hat, main hat tank with three defenses. Cannot believe it. I think I got something like that for shirts as well. I think I got a perfect for shirts somewhere. But I'm still trying to get my stuff up. Like, I got to re roll and re roll and re roll. And I wasted all of my. Um, my shells from the last Blood Fest Transformers, I got nothing good. I got a couple doubles, but no triples, so unfortunately, I'm just pretty unlucky when it comes to that. But we're going to go online on Turf War. We have um, all these people coming through, and I'm um, hopefully I can get my gear up. So one more time, if you guys enjoy yourself, don't forget to demolish that like button for me. Help the video to see 500 likes. If you want to see more Splat Down Live and Splat Down, the video on demand series in your sub box in the future. So we have an Octo Brush, a Roller. See, this is... I, oh my god, so many rollers. See, so many people are thinking the same way I was, but... It's a little more to that. I feel like the slosher is like A1 for this map. Here's something I like to do. Throw that right there. There we go. Save a little bit of ink. Not to mention time. Remember, this is turf war, so we're covering turf. I see that down in the lower. There's a bomb right there. Thank you, bomb sniffer. Oh, shoot! Ah! Where did he come from? Did he... Yeah, he was up in my area. Wow. Oh, well. That's the first time I've ever seen Bomb Sniffer used. Like, I'm actually just leveling it up. And Bomb Sniffer isn't terrible, so you won't get screwed over and, like, get splatted. So I can um, cover up some turf over here, because nobody on my team covered it up. Which I guess is cool. I'm just going to drop that right there. Oh, never mind. I made a mistake. I'll receive with a rat. Oh shoot. It's coming up behind me. What the? That was. That, Y'all not just see that? It just went nowhere. Fast. Come on. Get up there. Yeah, that's my area now. Look at this. So, look at all this uncovered turf. New turf smell. Do I smell that? Mmm. Smells like new turf. Did they lose somebody? They didn't lose anybody. So where the heck are they? Oh, they're over on the left side. They're in our area. Shoot. We good. Alright, let's go. Is he still behind me? No, okay. He gave up. Sweet. He's coming. He's he's staying elevated. I gotta get out of here. It's not safe for me. Sorry, bro. 
That's the thing about Diamond Rollers. They get too close, like you're pretty much dead meat. So we only got once, right? Drop that right there. Get out of there, buddy. Ha -ha! Remember, it's the last minute. In the last minute of the game, you really want to try and just cover up turf. Don't really worry about um, getting kills and none of that. Just Gotcha. I mean, unless you can get a kill at the same time. Like, if you can, then by all means do it. I feel like we won. We have the majority of the mat handled. But let's wait and see. Oh, I need to mention something. Um, wait. Hey, 51 to 31. Or 50 to 31. Excuse me. Pretty much 51%. But in any case, um, there's going to be a little bit of a continuity issue. Because accidentally, the original episode 9 of Splatdown got... Corrupted. I couldn't do anything about it. So, you're going to see episode 11 talking about me getting revenge or whatnot because I'm salty because I lost in a very basic uh, map combination and turf war. Um, so, I go to my roller and I just rock out. But unfortunately, this is a redo because the original one got deleted. So, just letting y'all know that right now that it's going to be a little bit of a continuity issue. Alright, Moray Tower. This is going to be really good. The elevation is still like crazy, but once again, the Slosher can handle it. So you have an E-Leader. Ooh, we have a really good one. An E-Leader, a Slosher, a Tenetech, and a... Uh, is that a Crack One Roller or a Splat Roller? Not sure. But either way, we're going to be covering Turf. Yo, this is a really good um, set of match... Uh, a really good set of weapons. There you go. Cover all this. I'm glad my teammate is trusting me with this. Almost there. I just want to run out my 8 now before I launch this. Actually, no, let's launch it now. Get out of there. Bye, he's dead. What the heck? How do you survive? That's not good. We're living. Nah, son. A for effort, though. Definitely A for effort. Like you went in the smallest covers possible. They're pushing y'all back. Ooh, we know where they're at! Yo, whoever it is the E-leader. It's definitely the E-leader. Bruh. What the heck? How did he take both of us out? No way. There's actually a whole area about wow, I didn't notice that. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna cover that up right now. Because it will give me another um, ink strike, too. Yo, right here, I don't know if you guys know this, but only the gray part is what counts towards the overall goal. Like, the other part, it doesn't really count. Like, towards the um, ink cover, because you know it's going vertical. So, only the part that's gray right there actually counts. Gotcha. Yo, whoever was there for me, thank you. We killed him. Who did that? Was that the, um, the leader? We have an E-Leader versus a Charger, which is still just a great... Hey, I'm just making sure there's nobody over there. Oh, shoot. We out, boys! He didn't notice me. Wait. Come on. Gotcha. There we go. Drop that right there. Thank you, Bob Stiff, to be honest. Somebody over there, yo. Ah, the bomb. I don't think he knows that somebody's right behind him. Yeah, he wanted me. Yo, he was charging that up. You could, he was waiting there like, let me just body this guy real quick. But nah. 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 So I messed up at the end. I got caught by the um, bomb. I don't know why I didn't just um, take a more open spot. That's what I should have did. But we were still uh, most points 
most turf cover for our team. 4 to 2 was our KD ratio. And we're getting our Bomb Sniffer up. I never really used Bomb Sniffer before. It's my first time really using it, but I like it. I think it's a really good ability. A little note. If you don't want to play with Japanese people because they're really, really laggy, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, ooh, our team again is going in. They have an elite or two, though. All right, so it's going to be a good match. Um, but yeah, and what is it? And you, like, they do lag. If you don't know what I'm talking about, come out to my um, my back down live streams. You'll see some laggy Japanese players. So irritating. But yeah, if you don't want to deal with that, um, don't play at night. I would recommend anything past 10 p.m. is a no-go. Oh, you do. I'm gonna have to sniper me. What the? That explains why he was so confident in staying there. Dang it! Ugh! Freaking splatter shot, Junior. I'm telling you, the only reason why that weapon is a threat is because of the bubble. It's the only reason. If it wasn't for the bubble, nobody would fear the splatter shot. You guys can argue with me if you like in the comment section below. But I am firmly confident that the only reason why that weapon is new at all is because it's one of the few weapons with a bubble. Serious? How the heck was I missing that much of a slosh? Okay, awesome. I like how you can actually see the arrows floating though. That's kind of a cool effect. Oh no. See, with a slosh, I would definitely always recommend. Dang. He has strength up. I knew it. I called it. Only two bombs. And yet, like, that's a really good idea. Alright, we're gonna. Oh, jump to the wrong guy. Oh well. There's a lot of our own area that isn't covered. Again, two of them at once. All right, that's cool. There we go. Take him out. Nice try. Yeah, I did. I need to get some up there, sir. Gotcha. I won. I come up their turf more so than make my own. Come on. Come on. I was just sloshing it. We lost though. They got all the way in our area. That is disgusting. Like I was holding their sniper off and they still did all that work. What? I'm a little disappointed by that one. I'll admit. I'll admit I'm a little disappointed by that one. I was coming up the most turf though. Um, although this tennis tech had the most kills. Whoever had that roller wasn't doing a darn thing. That was not the same team we had on Moray Towers. But in any case, that's going to end off today's Turf War 2 to 1. I'm okay with that. If you guys enjoyed yourself, don't forget to demolish that like button for me. Your support goes so far. Thank you all for continuing to support the PK Planet as a whole. And of course, make sure you guys check out episode, episodes of Splatdown. Link to the playlist in the description below. But that all said and done, that's my time with you all today. Thank you all very much for watching. Stay hot, guys. And I'll see y'all next time.